Love Cyclone Fanatics, football season just around the corner and we are here talking with Tron today and Wilson Toyota of Ames 2212 South Duff Avenue. He's Tron Smith, I'm Chris Williams, although some folks around the Iowa State community like to refer to us as twins. Uh, we are nothing but that. So don't, you know, yeah. don't don't mix us up when you're looking at each other. What's yeah, up, man? sometimes that happens. People confuse me. You know, I was I was yeah. I was in a mall the other day to say, "Hey, Chris, Chris," and I'm like, "Chris, I'm I, not, I know, I mean, I know." I've been working out. If you can't tell, uh, you know, I, it's, you know, it's the shirt. You know, black hides things. You only know, wear black clothes. It makes you smaller. So. Evidently, Tron, we we got football season. Man, I'm amped. It's fired up, ready to go. We got all sorts of big plans with the Cyclone Fanatic Wilson Toyota pregame show again, of course. We, we, we're going to unveil all of that here as the next month rolls along. But, you know, Tron, I went to the Cyclone Gridiron Club golf outing a couple weeks ago. Sat down and talked to my boy Jay Chapman. He's our guy. We love Jay Chapman, president of the Gridiron Club. Saw Mike Lacey there. Of course, Mike was having a good time. Mike's, no, Mike's, Mike's mommy. That's, that's, that's your boy. guy. Yeah. All right. Um, you know, we set that goal at 1,000 for 1,000 yeah. Cyclone Gridiron Club members. Because you know what? For, for, for Cyclone fans, that's, that's, that's a drop in the hat. That's, that's nothing. It's the holy grail. We need to get to 1,000 before kickoff. Right there, about there. We're about there. They've, We're, they've you, eclipsed 500. They're, they're nearing six. We need at least 400 more people here by the time kickoff I, I think we can around. do it. You know what, Cyclone fanatics? Here's the deal. It's just really cut and dry. It's really simple. Everybody in this program is going out to make sure that things. I got a chance to go up and check out this scoreboard. Oh my goodness! Ridiculous, I mean, it, dude! It's, it's, it's like King Kong right in the middle of Jack Trice Stadium. It's unbelievable. This thing is huge, but everybody's investing their time and money into getting this thing going. One thing that I think we really need to invest in is this Great Iron Club. Man, I, I'm serious. I keep going back to this. If you have not done an event, if you have not been a part of it, we're going to get together, me and Chris. We're going to throw another event here before too long. We'll work yep. on that. Yep. But you have to come out and be a part of this. And you know what? Just take the opportunity to see what these guys. Listen, these guys party. If you like to party, these guys party. Now, there's also some more incentives to join the Gridiron Club now. And this is, see, I can't be a part of it because of my job. I can't ethically and do all that stuff. And this stinks because if I was just like an ordinary fan, I would be all over this. Because what they're going to do is they're going to be testing out the scoreboard and using it in these big scrimmages that are coming yeah. up that are exclusive to Gridiron Club members. So not only do you get a sneak peek at the team, but at the scoreboard you get to see all that jazz as well. In action. You yeah. know, it's, it's, it's one thing to, to see this thing. You know, Right now you can drive by, you can see it, but it's another thing to see the thing in action, see replays and things like that. You know, the Gridiron Club is going to give you the opportunity to be there. And not only that, not only the scoreboard, you know, how many people can really say, hey, you know what, I saw this. You know, I saw this team before they actually hit the field. Football season's coming. You know, eventually you're not going to be able to, I mean, it's, this thing is, is going to grow like a, like wild brush, you know, brush fires, man. Paul Rhodes believes that. Talked to him down at uh, Big 12 Media Days last week, Tron. Um, you know, I got a hint of disrespect, I think, towards Iowa State. Not, you know, and they were picked to finish above Kansas, okay? But still, I saw more media paying attention to Turner Gill than I did Paul Rhodes than Kansas' players above Iowa State's players. And this is something you come to expect. When this is ha this is not the first time this has happened, but but I'm starting to sense from players I've talked to, I think from coaches I've talked to, I'm starting to sense a little bit of all right. I'm a little bit irritated with this now because what I'm seeing is Paul Rhodes has said numerous times it's the best football team he's had at Iowa State, right? Mm -hmm. Yet they're getting less respect than they did. Two years ago for sure, or last year for sure. I don't know about two years ago. They were picked dead last in the Big Twelve. Point being, I'm, I'm starting to sense like a ticked off, backs against the wall attitude from these guys that I haven't really felt here at Iowa State. This is third year. This is supposed to be your best, but nobody's giving me credit for that. And, you know, and two things, two points to that. One thing I'll tell you this. As a program, you have to think big if you want to be big. And, and the deal is this. The coaches, they feel it, they sense it, and that's why they're getting that kind of feeling. They're like, wait a minute, wait a minute now. Three years in, I, you know, I know that I'm doing it. I have a better squad here. We're going to be better this year. Forget the forget the fact that the schedule is what it is. We're going to have a better – it's going to be more exciting even if, you, if we don't win a lot of these balls. Yeah. They're definitely going to be exciting. But you know what? These coaches are thinking big. Us as fans, we have to think big also. You know what? We, we talked about this before. When you look at the Gridiron Club and what they do for the football program, now keep in mind we're not saying, you know, don't sign up for other programs in the university. We yeah. want you to be a part of everything when it comes to the university. But right now we're talking football. 
The Gridiron Club does a lot for this football program. We got to have one of the smallest Gridiron Clubs out there. I mean, it's got to be. I'd be curious to see the numbers on this deal. Us as fans, we have to be a part of this. We have to get it going. And we have to make sure that when we go places, we show the same pride that these coaches are showing. Because you know what? If you haven't bought in yet, I'll tell you, I'm in, Chris is in, and these coaches are in. So we need to back these guys. Second thing is, and I can say this while he's sitting here, I, I, want to under, I want all you fanatics to understand one thing. This guy right here done a great job going down to Texas and making sure that if you weren't there or you couldn't follow this thing on TV, that you had it hand by hand. When you see him, you make sure you give him a pat on the back and tell him, you know what, good job, because I enjoyed it. I was able to work and still follow this thing as it went step by step. So I appreciate you, my friend. Well, thank you, John. And that, you know, Instead of a pat on the back, I will take hugs, too. I'm not going to hug you. Yeah, I'm just, uh, just saying. I, I'm not going to hug you. I, just, it's kind of weird, man. It, I'm just saying. I take hugs. I take hugs. <laughs> you need to get a sign. No, really. I, I appreciate hugs. it. So I'll get one opinion from you before we let everybody go. My good friend Ken Miller, 1460KXNO, he's a Vegas guru. He knows all the gambling stuff. Mm -hmm. Talks to a couple of his buddies who work in Vegas. Wants them to set an over-under on wins for Iowa State this year. Put it at three. I'm going to give you, well, okay, Tron, you have to bet, uh, let's just say $10,000 of your own money. Where are you putting? Oh, Over. Over. We'll win more than three games. Period. You, you seem pretty confident. Uh, you know what? I don't only seem, I'm telling you, we will win more than three. Listen, the best position you can be in is a position that no one cares. No one's watching. You know what? The only team that's really looking at us saying, listen, we got us, you know, we, we could lose is Kansas. That's exactly where I want to be. I'm sure Paul's thinking the same thing. That's fine. Everybody wants to put us under the radar. Listen, Texas, that's what you did last year. You see what happened? That's what happens when teams don't expect you to do big things. You do big things. So, yeah, I'm taking it. 10,000, 20,000, 30,000. We'll win. We will win more than three games. I told you we'll beat Texas last year. We beat Texas. This message has been Tron approved. Here at Wilson Toyota Banks. Tron, uh, folks in the market for a Toyota right now, we got some good deals going on. We got some Avalons behind oh, us man. today. These things are these things are gorgeous. I wish you would have shown me one of these bad boys when I bought that Camry last no, year. No, no, you know, I gotta leave something, you know, so you can want to come back. We work you know, up. We gotta upgrade. Yeah, That's all right, but upgrade. we can do that. But you now is a great time to buy a Toyota if you're interested. Zero percent pretty much on just about everything we have. Uh the Iowa State truck, the, the Oh, that's Woo! It's beautiful. Nasty. Man, if you haven't seen this thing, it's coming. It's right. coming. But, you know, a great opportunity. Any any questions, any things like that, stop in. 2212 South Duff Avenue. Or just give me a call. 515-598-2029. And that is direct to my office. Well, that's direct. So, and even if you're ticked off about a video or something like that, Trump, Trump, we'll talk he about loves it. hearing from you. Oh, especially if you're a Hawk fan, because somehow you all watch this thing anyway. That's good. Hey, you know what? Thanks for supporting us, by the way. We do. We appreciate the clicks and the, the page views and all that good stuff. So, Tron. We'll be back. Uh, we'll, we'll see you next week. We're going to be talking with Tron from here on out until the end of football, until the end of basketball season. We're looking forward to another strong athletic season. Uh, not only wins and losses, but our partnership with Cycle and Fanatic and Wilson Toyota. We, we love doing all this stuff. we got some really exciting things planned for you. The off season. Well, media day is Thursday. Off season is it's over, over with. Yeah, it's, it's, official, over it's with. officially done, and we're looking forward to it. And you know what? I'll tell you this, Fanatics. Big plans for this year. Big plans. Big plans. Giant plans. Think big. Taking it to a new level. Thanks to Tron. Uh, thanks to Danny Wilson. Uh, we will see all of you soon here talking with Tron at Wilson Toyota, 2212 South Duff Avenue in Ames.